Hi, Steve. Hi, Jeremiah. Um, this isn't my favorite thing to have to do. <laughs> you got my tooth. You slid it in my mouth. You have to keep your mouth, you have to keep your mouth closed. You got keep my your mouth closed. Okay, you, uh, you too. How you doing over there? I'm doing real good. I like that we both chose stripes separately. Don't you love it? It looks really good. You too. Yeah, man. Oh, you're wearing a... I'm wearing stripes too. Yeah, I'm wearing blue stripes. You're wearing, I'm wearing red and purple stripes. Yeah. What do you got going on there? Uh, you're holding I... the guitar and everything? <laughs> <laughs> I, may have wrote, I may have written another song. Let's get it done. I want to hear it. Do you want to know the title or should I just go right into it? Uh, do you want to be surprised? Me. You want to be surprised? Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Okay. I love you, and you love me, and though we're not blood, we're still family. I ride with you till the end of days. I'll be your wingman, and I'll help you get laid. Cause you're my brother from another mother And I let you totally smash my mom And according to my mom That kitty is the bomb And I know you've been accused of simping But Steve, you're straight up pimping Bust out that harmonica So it's time to spread those wings and start acting like a king. I'm a married man, so here's my plan. I want you swimming in pool, the same. Swimming in the deep end, a pussy. Every day of the week, I want your dick to have some treats. And then I want to hear every freaking detail Was it round? Was it small? Did she have big walls? How did your penis compare? Did she have sweet nips? Did she have french tips? Was she dark skinned or fair? Did you come real fast? Did you tap that ass? Did you bust everywhere? Was she the girl of your dreams? Did you use Vaseline or were you living a nightmare? Cause I love you And you love me And though we're not blood We're still family I'll ride with you Till the end feel about that one you don't know how you feel what do you mean uh, i don't know about the pity party here the pity party yeah, what are you everyone, talking about what's coming at me with the pity party i i just king in the sting wanting to do a date show that song i just talk, what I, am i mr I, miyagi come here can't get nothing 
<laughs> Mr. Miyagi is yeah, too old. That's a weird analogy. Well, I don't know. Good job. <laughs> Good job. I I wrote a whole I know, song about I know. how I wanted you I to felt get a little uncomfortable with though. ladies. A little uncomfortable. Because you brought your mom in the mix. Yeah, but she. You, I thought you guys were a thing. Dude, it's... Oh, just breathe, Steve. Breathe. Intro nose. It's your mom. It's your mom. Respect. Okay, okay. Respect. But did you like it? I did. It was catchy. Okay, thank it you. It was catchy. Good job. You know that one? Yeah, it, got, it was catchy. Good yeah, job. Right. You know that part? Good. Okay. I know. I know. I uh, know. Uh, I get you. it. I get it. Right? Yeah. You it was almost like a little, like brotherhood, but a little. It's brotherhood. Yeah. Okay. Well, leave it at that. I, I brotherhood. I literally am talking about being your wingman, getting ladies. I know, dude. Thank time. you, thank you, thank you. My, you know what? I'm looking at it wrong. I'm looking at it wrong. That was really thought provoking. Thank just, you. Yeah. Okay. Glad you like it. Okay. It's fine. Okay. Good. Okay. Thank you. How you feeling? I can't wait for the challenge today. It's going to be a good one. No more pain this week. Can we make an agreement on the what? challenges in the future? What? From this day forward, no truces are allowed. I'm too competitive. I, we got to make finite things. It's it's irked me all last week that, that we had another truce last week. Yep. So they have to be It has to definitive. be definitive. Definitive. I cannot do another Is one. Is that the right word? Yeah, definitive. That's definitive. A definitive thing. It has to be. We're both too competitive. We'll we'll do it. You know what I mean? There has okay. to be like a, a time limit or something. With it has challenges. to be there has to be a clear winner it has to and be a clear, clear loser. Yeah. All right. Thanks for letting me know, man. In my what, defense, what? in my defense, I thought the electrocution one Someone was going to quit. Yeah, I did too. It hurt bad. I it know. was like, remember Street Fighter? Yeah. Blanca? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bzz, yeah. Yeah. People like it. Exactly like that. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. What do, you, what do you say we flip the format on its head? What do you mean? What if we did the challenge right now? Yeah? It's never been done before on this show. Oh, I'm so glad you said that. So this week... No eating, no pain. There's no pain involved. Thank goodness. We need a and little this break. Is, and get, get this. There will be a definitive winner. Good. I love it. Because there's judges involved. There's judges involved? Oh, yeah. Can I break it out? Let me know. I'm really interested now. There's judges involved. There's no pain. Okay. Now, this is going to be called... The makeup challenge. I went to Target. I don't know anything about makeup. Never put it on. Don't know what things are. But this is my idea. So I don't even... I bought this kit. I bought this. I bought this uh, eyelash thing. Let me just display some of this stuff that I bought. We're going to do each other's makeup. And uh, the only thing is, it's a, yeah, whoever does the best job wins. And we're going to have some judges deciding. And then I have this uh, pencil, right? So, okay, and then so I have this brush. But I could only afford one. So I hope you don't, I hope you don't get mad. I uh, took some of your wife's makeup. My wife gave you some of her makeup? Yeah, because... To know, use my on me? Is, yeah, well... Yeah, so... You couldn't afford two makeup kits? This was $48. Okay, sorry. I didn't know it was that much. I didn't know makeup was so expensive. Me neither. The ladies... Lip, lipstick, so... Ladies, thank you for your service. I didn't know that was yeah, that expensive. Yeah, I didn't know. So this is your kit from your wife. She gave you, that's nice. She put it in a Ziploc bag for you. Yeah. So your wife loves you. She wants you to get involved with the channel. Okay. So you use my wife's makeup on me and I'll use that brand new kit on you. Oh, you're trying to flip it on me, huh? I'm not, I'm not going to let, I'm not going to put my wife's makeup on you. Wait, say that. I'm kind of confused. So I. You're put, using that, uh, my wife's kit on me. So it stays with my wife and I, our germs. 
Oh, and then I use the brand there. new kit on you. All right, dude. I want to make it as fair as possible. It's fair. And then, you know, that's, I'm fine with it. There's morality involved too. <laughs> there's always morality on this. Okay, so let's podcast. do it. You use, I use this. Oh, you use this on me? Dude, we got it. I, I, I. Wait, wait, hold up. Say it one more time. It's what I use, I use the new kit on you. Okay, because you it's use new. my wife's kit on me. Yeah. Oh, to keep it in the family. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So it's the make the Scissor Bros makeup challenge. What? <laughs> I know nothing about makeup. You don't either. I take it. Okay, so we picked out these wigs for each other. <laughs> yeah. Because they're both blonde wigs. We want this to be as even of a playing field as possible. And the whole goal, right? Is, is to make each other look the best. The best. The as best. As hot as possible. As, yeah, the, the, the best. Okay. So whoever looks the best is the winner. And you said you have some judges lined up? Yeah, female judges. Don't worry about it. Okay. We got it. We got it. All right. What What are you holding? I don't know what this is called. I know nothing about makeup. <laughs> nothing. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. But we have to have, yeah, when we do each other's faces, you have to have your eyes closed because, is it called eyelash? Yeah. Eyelashes? Yeah. <laughs> These? Yeah. They're called eyelashes. Okay. I mean, no, I'm, I'm talking about that makeup what? thing. The eyelash thing. Oh, the curl? The, yeah. I don't even know what they're. All right. Yeah. Let's, uh, you ready? <laughs> there's there's like women who are watching this that are already cringing. Like, they don't know the name. I don't of know the name. Let's just do it. I'm just going to guess. Okay. okay. You have to have your eyes closed, though. Yeah. What are you doing? Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna use. Okay. Uh, okay. Fine. You want me to close my eyes? Yeah. Okay. I'll close my eyes. Well, I go. Well, we're doing it separate. Huh? Well, you said I can't. I can't put it on you while I'm. My eyes okay. are closed. Okay. I can already tell you. You're, uh, I'm gonna look like a nightmare. <laughs> okay. You know what? You started with that. I'm just gonna get this red lipstick on Steve right away. Yeah. You pucker up too. Okay. Fine. You Here we'll do it. We'll too. do it at the same time. Oh my god. Oh. Mm. 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 Oh, my tooth. <laughs> You're cheating. Keep your mouth closed. You got my tooth. You slid it in my mouth. You have, and you, keep your mouth. Your... you have to keep your mouth closed. You got keep my your tooth. mouth closed. Okay, you uh, you too. <laughs> keep your mouth closed. Keep your mouth okay. Messed up. You keep mess. your mouth closed. You're cheating. I'm crying. Keep already. your mouth closed. Yeah, keep messed up. You're looking at the camera. You're keep your mouth closed. You, keep. You look really good, dude. You do too. You look really, really uh, I'm good. I'm having fun. Okay. Okay. Oh my goodness. Okay. Uh, uh now, uh, ladies, uh, and gentlemen, and uh, all genders, really. Um, we're going to do, um, uh, I'm going to put some foundation. Don't, you don't have to do it. Just on. do it. Just do okay. it. Because I'm going to do my thing too. Come on, oh, man. Okay. 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 Here, look at me. What? Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, so you're going straight for that. Oh, hold up. You just turned away. I, right. You messed up my thing. I'm, right. I'm looking, okay. I'm looking for my, here. Um, one second. I think I did this wrong. This is not for the cheek, huh? <laughs> Wait, what? I don't know what I'm doing. All right, here. Let me. All right, now Steve's uh, skin tone, um, I think, is going to go really well with a little bit of orange. (laughs) (laughs) Then a a hint of pink. No, you can't steal my color. That's my color. (laughs) No. You're stealing my idea. No. no. Hold up. Dude, look at me, man. I, you're messing up. I'm trying to do my thing. It's of green for oh, the. Oh. The accent, <laughs> <laughs> hey, yeah. the accent, the okay. nose. I'm gonna use it all. Oh, 
Add a little bit of white. <laughs> <laughs> for this shit. Oh, my God. Add a little bit of white. Hold on. I'm accidentally making you look like Ronald McDonald. Hold on. You look great. You look really hot, dude. dude. You look, it's you bringing look out so much oh, no. healthy color in your dude, cheeks. You're, this is literally this is making fantastic. me cry a lot. Oh, God. Now, as you can tell. You look like a nightmare right now. <laughs> oh, just, and I'm, you look like I'm a just hot piece. You, know, you look you like, look like, you a, look like a serial killer. <laughs> Now, we need to make sure that Steve's fierce eyes don't get lost in this. So, uh, <laughs> I don't even think this is for the right, for the eyes. Uh, it's okay, just, just, just try to guess. I think this is for uh, eyelashes. I think I'm using it for your eyebrows. Just, uh, here. Oh, God, this is a nightmare. All right, go ahead, go ahead. I have to do this thing with you. I need to get eyelashes. Okay, okay, okay. 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 I'm yeah. next, so I have all to right, do your eyelashes. Right. You can't just... That, you know, I don't want you to have an advantage with the eyelashes. Right. Well, you're... I, mean, I need to even the eyelash. Dude, you don't have to get in my eyeball. Dude, you got to... You got to in my eye... Dude, oh, please. Be careful. Be careful. What are you doing, dude? <laughs> what you, it's my turn now. Okay, okay. You had okay. enough time. Here, okay, it's my okay. turn now. All right. Close your eyes. Oh, no. Close your eyes. Ow. Ow. <laughs> Turn towards me. Ow, this... <laughs> oh, this... You look like a nightmare. It's all scratchy. <laughs> it's all monster. scratchy. Close your eyes. <laughs> Ow. Freaking hurt. Okay. All right. How are we doing, man? I think we're pretty good. And then okay. basically, um, uh, uh, look at me. and then basically we're going to seal it. We're going to seal the deal. Yeah. I'm going to put a little bit of, um, uh, 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 now this is really, uh, this is, uh, concealant, um, that, that we put on, on, <laughs> on Steve to really seal. I think this is just to, to, to cement everything down. I think this is like called cement paste or something well, like this. You don't steal all the colors though. You, see, I need to use that too. Here, I know. Wow, you look, you're starting to look, wait a second. What? You look really good. You do too. <laughs> Take a look at the camera. <laughs> I look like the Joker. <laughs> you son of a gun, you made me into the Joker. All right, I'm going to add one more okay, hold color on. and then I think that we're good. Some peach. Let me add some peach and we're good to go. Okay, this is fun, huh? Yeah, this is great. Yeah, I need to. Some more lip stuff like here. Get, try to try to get this. Okay, sorry. Hold up, I just hold up. I need to finish your lips. Out. Wait, you're going back to lip no, stuff? No, it's, there's no rules. <laughs> Is this a good idea? It's a great idea. Okay, I love oh, it. okay. So we don't, we can't make this forever. Like we get what you get. All right, are you done? All right, one second. Okay. Because I think I think you look great. <laughs> I think you look really good. Okay, Can great. I add a little bit more lip stuff since you did redid what mine? What do you mean? You redid Dude, mine. Dude, you put that's red lipstick though. It, you could already see it plays on camera. You could already know I. Alright, uh, so you added more than here. It's my turn now. I have to blue. How's your problem now? <laughs> you look beautiful. You look great. Wow, you look beautiful. <sighs> Looks so good. Okay. Okay. So should we call the first judge? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Okay. Yeah. So just keep in mind, folks, we've never done makeup before. This is where we just learned. If we're you, learning as we go. If you can believe it. This is actually our first time doing each other's makeup, makeup. or anybody's makeup. Yeah. I think that we did a really good job. Yeah. I think it looks really good. Um, Please, I hope I win this one. Let's get our first judge to call okay. in. We need an honest, yeah, go ahead. Boy. Okay, that's much better. Okay, that's there good. There you are. There you are. Our, our pal, Kelsey Cook. Hilarious stand-up comedian and makeup enthusiast is joining us on the show. You do literal tutorials online. We wanted to reach out to you and see basically 
out of my buddy Steve and I, who is the hotter woman? Because the competition is to check our makeup skills. So I did his makeup, he did mine, and we need you to decide who looks better as a woman today just based on how you apply <laughs> makeup and stuff. Be honest. You have to be honest. I know we both look really good. I was going to say, you both are so stunningly beautiful right now that Thank it's you. like, it's going to be tough. Um, I'm just trying to really like drink it all in what's happening. Drink it up. It's a lot. We've got a, aggressive lip colors. Yes. I'll, I'll show you a little bit more. So I've got the blues. This is uh, to give you uh, an idea of what I'm working with, okay? Yeah. Okay, wow. And then this is... And then here is my buddy Steve. So, I have some questions about color placement. Why green around the nose? Uh, Was that... I put green around your nose. Okay. Because... um, uh, Steve, um, for me personally, like I am more of a person who likes big noses because I have a big nose and I wanted to accent that area around him because he has a small little petite nose and I thought it could use a little bit of emphasis. Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, you want to curse everybody. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Exactly. You're like, if I'm going down, we're all going down. Yeah. Yeah. You know, but all in a cute way, because I think. He looks good. Who looks better, though? That's all we need to know. Who looks better, him or me? Wow, okay. <laughs> go back to me. I'm going to go with Jeremiah. I look... Woo! Wait, you're... <laughs> Come bam! You're saying that... Yeah, I love you, Kelsey. I love you. You're, Thank you. You're, you're saying that... Woo! You're saying I look better than Steve. Thank you so much for your honest feedback and opinion. I love you for that. Thank you so much. Woo! I won that one. That that's your that's your decision. Thank you. She's honest. There's no incentive for I her mean, to that's, lie. I mean, that's a compliment to you that you look nice. Okay. Well. Nice. All right, so all right, so Steve gets the first vote. Okay, thank, thank you so much. I love you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Woo! thank you for taking the time to do this with us. Uh, follow Kelsey Cook online and uh, check out her stand up and her podcast. And uh, we love you. Thanks so much for being a judge on Bullseye. Scissor Bros. Love you. We'll see you soon. Bullseye. Bullseye. <laughs> yes. Ugh. Let's do a couple scissors, dude. No, 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 you stop. I gotta catch up. Stop, stop, stop. Alright, who's our next judge? What if it's a tiebreaker? Sometimes you gotta get angry scissors. Relax. Sometimes you gotta get angry scissors. Relax and relax. You got to sometimes. Let's let's give him a call. Okay. All right. Oh my god. Hey. Hi, Annie. Yes. Honestly, okay. Wait. Hold on. Who looks better? Who just? Steve? Who looks better? Right, here's the issue. Can I just tell you what my issue is? Yes. It's like my narcissism and then my boyfriend. So like my boyfriend's Asian. So I want to say you look the prettiest because you look like a pretty version of my boyfriend but then that also sounds a little racist because not all asians look alike but then i you look like me jeremiah so like what i i think i have to go narcissism i'm sorry well you know what wait pull back pull back pull well back. this is the whole thing is who did a better makeup job yeah who did a better makeup yeah, job just that's it. oh on the other one yeah so who made the the other person look better? So just decide yeah, who, who just, looks better. Yeah, who looks better as far as makeup wise, not not um as far as features and and stuff. Just like the makeup job. Did I hurt you guys' feelings just then? No. No, no, no. Okay. Not at all. No, we're just. We I don't just want to lose my King Sim. Um. Lord. I'm gonna say. Listen, I'm gonna say that I like the purple lipstick, and I think that um, Stevie did the best job. Yes. Thank you. I love you, Annie. You didn't go red because you didn't go trite. It's like it's kind of like obvious to do red lipstick. Yeah. 
All right, well, I have to go do my spot. I pulled over on the side of the road for this. I love you. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. We, we love, love you. you. Thank right, you, bye, Annie. Guys. We'll talk to you soon. Bye. bye. I had so much fun on both of your podcasts. Thank you. Yes. Bye. Thank you for doing bye. it. Bye. Oh, God. This calls for a celebration. My first freaking win. Let me do a harmonica or something. Here, just just what, stay here. What do you, what's wrong? Let's do a post chat interview. What? Let's do a post chat interview. What do you mean a post chat interview? I'm gonna talk to you right now. Right now? Right now. Okay, I won. I'm sorry. It, it just oh, this is a historical look. It took till was this episode eight? Yeah. So Stevie has not won one challenge. It's a historical night. He gets one win. I have he starts won. referring to himself in the third person Hold already. Up. I have won. My very first challenge on Scissor Bros podcast. Victory! Get your ice cream ready. Get your cake ready. Break out the champagne. And it's it, this calls for a freaking celebration. How do you want to celebrate? Well, you're going to have to keep your makeup on throughout. I could wipe mine off, though, because you said if whoever wins or loses... The other one could wipe it off. So that means you're going to have to uh, keep whatever's going on there on, and I get to uh, wipe mine off and just be normal again. So you're going to have to, throughout, I don't know how much time we got. Uh, we got a lot of We got a lot of time. We got a lot of, we got a lot of time. Left. So you're going to have to sit there with your blue lipstick, with this Buffalo Bill vibe you got. I get to go over there, wash all. I take and all. And you get to look normal. I, I get to look normal. I did. You have to sit. I in did it. tell Steve off. I'll I'll be honest. I did tell Steve that off camera that the loser had to keep it on the rest of the the mm. rest of the. I love it. What a great night. What a great night. I love you, but what a great night. I I love you, buddy. But this it's is my this first, is hard for me. Why? It's you. I can't win one. What? Hold Be, up, let's. You got a few let, truces in the in a row that I've I gotten. Hate. I know, but I hate, I've never got no win. Them. I've never got no win. Be happy for me. I'm happy for you. This so is a to, big night. This to is a big all night. my bro, uh, scissor brothers and sisters, it's time to celebrate. And you know what? We Stevie should celebrate has with? won his first challenge. You know what we should should celebrate with what? Some cookie time. Oh, cookie time. You ready for your surprise? Yeah, I'm sitting here. <laughs> what do you got? Are you pumped? A little bit. Those donuts, what do you got? Nope. Oh, well, I see the box. Whoa, there's sprinkle. There's chocolate chip cookies, fudge cookies, and chocolates. And But it looks like there's uh, glitter. Where'd you get these? <laughs> Where'd you get these? These oh. are glitter. Cookies. Oh, so you keep edible glitter? Mm hmm. R Dude, is this some kind of. This isn't a proper thing. Is the, this is the real deal. This is, but this is not a gag. Like, I'm not going to get diarrhea. Or, no, there's not X locks or anything in them. There's nothing crazy. I figured we'd just take a cookie break. So, this is the second is the cookie break? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Could I grab. You want me to grab a cookie? Grab a cookie. Okay. I grab this one. Okay. I'll wait for you. Yeah. So, we're just going to. Eat the cookie now. Yeah, we eat the, we eat the cookie now. Uh -huh. That's really good. Sometimes in your day, you just need a cookie break. Do you like this segment? I actually do like the cookie. Yeah. Um. The cookie is great. Where'd you get? What like? Where are these from? They're from Super Yum. Yum. Hmm. Are you sure you can eat? There's like glitter on it. Are you sure you can eat it? It's edible. It's like rich chocolate. Mm -hmm. it makes you thirsty, huh? So how are you? <laughs> <laughs> That's so awkward. I'm doing okay, man. I'm enjoying your cookie. So this is the whole idea is just eat a chocolate chip cookie. <laughs> eat, eat chocolate chip cookies. <laughs> That's the idea. Do okay. you like it? I do. I thought it was going to be a challenge. Or... So there's not a contest. We're just friends eating cookies. 
friends eating chocolate chip cookies. Can we not just be friends eating chocolate chip All right, cookies? No, no, I'm having a good time. I'm having a good time. You're beating me, though. What do you mean I'm beating you? You're almost done. Yeah. I'm a very competitive person. All right. You don't, don't, well, just enjoy, okay. just enjoy the cookie. I am, I am. It's good, it's good. Is, is it? Yeah, it's You good. like it? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Do you have any good cookie memories? <laughs> like, what? You mean? I didn't think. Yeah, no, no, I do, I do. I didn't think this bit through. <laughs> This is the thing. How simple I do a have a cookie memory though. As a kid, I just remember the main cookie our ho- household got. What was the main cookie? Chips Ahoy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I could also eat Oreos by the sleeve. Um, fam- and fudge stripes. Fudge stripes. Uh, Keebler fudge stripes. And yeah. uh, but the best, famous Amos. Those are pretty good. Pretty good, my mm-hmm, friend. Mm-hmm. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the cookie break. I hope you did, too. And um, if you happen to be watching this, go to their kitchen right now. Grab yourself a bag of cookies. If you have cookies, here, mm. we'll wait. We'll, we'll wait. Because wait. I'll, I'll eat. Here, we'll, we'll... Hold on. I haven't finished this one yet. Okay. <laughs> Let me swallow okay. the cookie. Please. All right. Okay. But then I'm going to feed you this one. Okay. This one's really good. Did you get your cookies yet? Come on, guys. We're waiting. You got to join in and eat some cookies with us. Oh, let me do a little promo. That's our that's our new shirt. The Scissor Bros. Uh, the first OG shirt that's available in the link in the description below. We have a more of a mana monochrome look because uh we found out that these are way too expensive to to print in bulk so but they're super comfortable they're super comfortable and they're super punk rock it's cool. and you could wear this every day of your life yeah every day of your life every day you, you wear this, this other cookie? i will hold up i'm still doing the commercial oh, no, you can wear it at the gym you could wear it at the bank it's a t-shirt you can wear get... it to, when you're getting coffee can we get back to the okay cookie? okay <laughs> Stop, wait, wait, the, what the hell is this you just threw this piece of chocolate in here? I thought it was a cookie break. <laughs> I threw the other... Dude, thing. my mouth is so dry right now. It's because of you. I threw the other things in my kitchen that what were you do? Oh, in there. Why did you do that? You because. just left it as one thing. Because it's just like, you know... Why do, might as well throw Skittles in there and Mambas. I wish I... If I did, if I you had them, what? then I would Since have. you brought this, I'll eat this. Mm. See? That's from C's Candy. What? Our friends have been dropping off stuff to my wife and I since she oh, just had the nice. baby. That's a good friend. I that's want to nice. bring. I want to no, share them you. with thank you. Thank you for the cookies. Though. I want to share them with you. Yeah. Have you tried this one yet? This is so really. Good. Is there coconut in here? I don't even know. Maybe. Oh my god! Let me drink this. Well, that's cookie time. Uh, cookie cookie time. break. Sorry. Cookie, cookie break. break with the scissor bros. Let's do a couple scissors. Hope you enjoyed your cookies at home with us. One, two, three. Bye. Back to the show. I'm telling you, you messed up on my lipstick lipstick here. <laughs> hey, will you do me a favor and just keep it on the rest of the episode? Yeah, you know, all right. I'll be a favor. Yeah. I don't, yeah. I, I don't love want, you, I, I don't want you to feel alone. I love you, dude. All right, let's do I it. I love you. Okay, I'll keep it on. Thank you, okay, man. Okay, okay. All right. Want me to head over there? Again? All right. Okay. Scissor Brothers! <laughs> Hey, what the heck is that thing in your mouth? Well, I'm glad you asked, Dr. Falatisha. This thing is called fume. Whoa, is that some kind of cigarette or vape or something? No. Well, I'm glad you asked. It's the opposite of that. I'm trying to quit all that stuff. Oh, really? So it's kind of like a hand-to-mouth replacement kind of thing? Exactamundo. It's actually natural oils, Dr. Falatisha. Wow! I mean, do they have some kind of different flavors or something for different people's palates? Exactly. There's a wide selection of cores which focus on flavor, aroma, 
and the specific effect you're looking for. And that looks like handcrafted Canadian wood, and I know a thing about handcrafted wood. Ah. That's very yum, yum, yum. observant. I'm glad he brought that up, because it is Canadian maple. Must taste hella good, too. Oh, they have delicious flavors. Do you want to know what kind they have? I'm guessing they have something like lemonberry bliss, uh, bubbly lime. What else? Peppermint, eucalyptus, Whoa. and on and on. That's yeah. incredible. I feel great. You know what? I think I'm going to head over to www.breathefume.com. That's breathe, F-U-M, and we're going to use the code Scissor Bros. To save 10% and help your loved one quit, quit today. today. That's fume. <laughs> Have you been having any dark thoughts lately, Tony? We'll talk about that during our next session. You're my friend. Sounds good. Okay, fume. Hey, Steve. Have you ever gotten too high from pot? <laughs> Yeah, it's the worst, man. Well, Cali Valley CBD has the answer to that. They specialize in federally legal indoor flower extracts and pre-rolls. It's legal in all 50 states? Yeah. And the best part is they ship it right to your door anywhere in the USA. Visit thecalivalley.com and use code SCISSORBROS for 15% off everything. Cali Valley. All of the relaxation, none, none of, of the anxiety. anxiety. SCISSORBROS is brought to you by, by Manscaped, who's the best in men's below-the-waist grooming. They're champions of the world. Manscaped offers precision engineered tools for your Keep family going. jewels. Keep going. Keep going. Manscaped just launched their fourth generation trimmer, the Lawmower 4.0. And boy, does it work great. It does work great. And it works great for trimming your friend's butt crack hair as well, not just pubes and balls and shafts and stuff. This is precision trimming at its finest. I mean, they've got a new light on there they've got a new travel lock so it doesn't start vibrating in your bag randomly and somebody thinks it's like you know a vibrator at the airport or something like that lots of new features with the lawnmower 4.0 absolutely are you really getting back there how's it looking steve it looks fantastic the lawnmower 4.0 even allows you to customize your trim through additional guard lengths with sizes one through four and with my butt you're gonna need that four absolutely it's time to get your own ball and hair and body trimmer with Manscaped to make the me time the best time and enhance your confidence with some nice, smooth boys. How's it looking back there? I'm it looks very smooth. It's probably the nicest it's ever looked. Oh, it looks so smooth and I fantastic. never look at it, so I don't know what it looks like. Trust me, I'm doing a great job. Well... Get 20% off and free shipping with the code SCISSORBROS at manscaped.com. That's 20% off with free shipping. <laughs> manscaped.com and use code scissor bros it tickles so much unlock your confidence and always use the right tools for the job with, with manscaped. manscaped i'm just taking a moment to appreciate how good you look you look fantastic too thank you very that much that blue lipstick oof that red lipstick i mean you look retro you look what do i look uh, like a hooker from a sting music video or a possessed J Japanese uh, woman that's possessed by a demon. <laughs> Ringo. Ringo? Ringu. Ringo, <laughs> that horror movie. I like how your like Japanese I'm... horror film <laughs> character is just like... Ringu. I, I'm a, I'm a Japanese <laughs> character. Like I came up from a well. I'm a Japanese character. I'm a Japanese character. <sighs> I know. Scary. What do I look like? You look like person Looks who good though, right? did a lot too much cocaine. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh huh. In like 1988, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and you got in a fight with your lover, and you just got out of the bar. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Nice. 
But and, and it, you just got done crying. You were making me cry, laugh immediately with that makeup challenge. I was dying. I was too, but it wasn't that fun. See, let's go. Let's add on to that. With the Scissor Bros podcast, you never know what you're gonna get. Two psychotic brothers. Deranged. Murder. Horror. Shocking. Scissor Brothers. You never know what to Obviously, expect. Obviously, look at us. Every week is going to be a whole different journey we don't know what we're and doing. experience, my friends. No idea. So Can to we... all my bro- scissor brothers and sisters, keep tuning in every week. Make sure you subscribe. Thank you for subscribing, the yeah. liking, the commenting. We say it every week, but we really do we appreciate really it. We really love it. We, we appreciate all the people who read... have already bought t-shirts and stuff. Oh, that's right. That link's in the description as links well. Thank in the you description. guys very much. Tell uh, scissor brothers and sisters who don't know about it that we are, that we exist. Yeah, that would be very helpful, yeah. to be honest. So do be happy for me. I'm very happy for you. So you let's are? do some happy happy scissor brother scissors, uh, scissors, uh, fun scissors. <laughs> what the hell was that? I don't know. I just... <laughs> you I, were like, <laughs> happy, happy scissors, uh, fun scissors, uh, scissors. Uh, how do you want to do it? Do you want to... Um, what about with your hair? Hair scissors. Hair scissors? Yeah, so you... you like re- crossing Reach them? your beautiful hair and then crisscross applesauce. Okay. <laughs> okay. One, One, two, two three, <laughs> four, four, five, six, six seven, seven. This whole podcast eight, is nightmare fuel. Nine, nine ten. ten. Do two, ten more. Eleven. Eleven. Twelve. 12 you do a voice. Thirteen. Fourteen. 14, Fifteen. 16, Sixteen. Is it worse? Seventeen. Deeper. Eighteen. 18 19, 19 and 20. 20. God, I would hate to have long hair. Like, women have to deal with I used this? to have long hair. You for did. For years. For years and years. How do you manage it? It's a lot, girls. Like, you have to constantly, like, get it oh, out of your face Oh, I was doing this stuff. all the time. And I still do this even when I have shorter hair because I, I try to get to get that tuck behind the ear. The perfect yeah. tuck. The perfect tuck. And it's not... My dick between my yeah. legs. It's hair behind my ear. The perfect tuck. The perfect scissor tuck. Yeah. That felt good, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got an email this week that I want to get into. We did. It, it was, was, let's just say it was a groundbreaking email. It was very groundbreaking. It came out of nowhere from left field. Came out of left, 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 left field. Yeah. Um. Now, we... Reached out to this person. Uh, we this, kept kept it anonymous. We kept it anonymous. The uh, lovely lady sent a very nice letter to Steve, which you can do as well at scissorbrospod at gmail.com. We, Thanks that's for where, that plug. That was of, a good plug. Of, of course. Mm-hmm. That's where we get our music submissions, yeah. our art submissions. And later in the show. Oh, not only that, challenge ideas. Challenge ideas. We love all them. them. He's taken all those into account. And, oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, and also later in the episode, as a, as a treat uh, for uh, our scissor brothers and scissor sisters, our scissor family, our scissor siblings, we love you guys. We're going to do a little um, uh, thank you video a little bit later uh, of submissions like tribute, that you sent. Like a little, a little tribute. tribute. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, do you so want to start? Wanna, how about you start? I'll, you I'll want pull me to it start it off? We, you start the We letter. switch every paragraph then. Okay. Okay. You that. ready? Yeah. And, and uh, this is just somebody who emailed uh, us out of the blue mm-hmm. uh, specifically for, for Steve. And... Uh, She wants to remain anonymous, and she's okay with us reading the letter, so go ahead. Okay. Hey, Scissor Bros. First off, I want to say thank you so much, Jeremiah and Stevie, for making such a chill, fun podcast and for always being so funny, honest, and positive. You guys are the best, and and it makes me and so many others feel so much better about life. LOL. I hope you guys don't think this is weird or lame. But whenever I put any of your guys' podcasts on, it's like I'm not alone, and I really appreciate you guys and the content you put out together and individually so much. I can't wait to see you guys grow even bigger than you both ever imagined and what crazy shit you both have planned next, smiley face. Now, I am going to be a little bit of a perv. So, so I have never done anything like this before. I don't even post on any social media besides YouTube comments and OnlyFans. 
So I am ridiculously anxious even typing this email, but I have been wanting to do this for over a month now, and I know Stevie is going through some stuff, and I know he has his own opinion opinions about OnlyFans, but sometimes a guy just wants to come without having to go anywhere or deal with anyone. I also believe my tits are super therapeutic. Ha ha. So maybe you know if Stevie likes if Stevie likes native girls with huge natural tits, a decent sized butt, some tattoos, long legs, a little chubby belly, and a cute face with dimples, then I would like to offer him a free year subscription to my OnlyFans. I literally expect nothing at all to happen from this. I don't know if anyone will even read this, let alone actually view my OnlyFans and redeem the free trial. I just worked up a lot of courage to finally do this, and I figured, why the hell not, lol. I would very much enjoy Stevie seeing my tits and enjoying me. Honestly, him coming for me would be such a dream. Happy blushing face. If not interested, I 100% completely understand and I'm so sorry to have even offered. If I went past the boundary, I completely apologize and I pinky promise I will never say anything like this again. I just had to take a chance and hope you guys understand. It is all peace and love. And of course, I will still support you guys no matter what. Heart, face, fluttering uh, emoji. This is the free trial link if Stevie is interested or even curious. Love the girl who is too nervous to sign my real name, but will let you see my tits. Steve, Steve, how do you, how do you feel about I that, feel, brother? I don't know how I feel. I just, this is what, let me state something. Hold up. <laughs> let me just state one thing. That's a lot. Hold that's up. A, that's a whole say, lot that's to a, take in. That's a lot to unload. That is. And did you unload? No. Because I don't want this to be turning into a a, a pity party for Steve. I wrote that song. I as- know. No, but the thing is, like, because I was just on King and the Sting part two, and it was, like, along the same lines as uh. this. Where they're like, man, we got to get you a girlfriend, man. Like, we'll do a dating show. And I'm like, no, 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 guys. Okay, so we'll pump the brakes. Huh? We'll pump the brakes. Well, I just, I, 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 I feel flattered. Ladies, you can go home. Go home, ladies. Steve doesn't want to see you tonight. <laughs> No, yep, no, no. go back to the cars. Yep. Sorry, Steve. I had like 13 girls that were going to come in here. and. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> All, All how right. scary is this? Me and this wig going. It just looks so wrong on so many different levels. <laughs> There's going to be like little, like, yeah, like gargoyles yeah. walking in here. <laughs> I'm here for Stevie. <laughs> I'm here for Stevie. Yeah. 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 Stevie yeah. single. <laughs> I heard Stevie likes to bust nuts. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So, you know, I, I, I'm flattered, and that took a lot of courage to write something like that. I'm glad she stayed anonymous, and, you know. Yeah. Uh, But, yeah, I just don't know. I don't. Did you? The co- moment I sign up for OnlyFans, that's, you know, for, that's in my in my head. <laughs> the moment I go, yeah, I'm going to go on Google, and, yeah, uh, create an email. Like, the moment I do that, because I already do, like, beta bucks. Simp type Wait, stuff. I am nice. What's beta bucks? Uh, it's uh alpha fucks beta bucks. What is that? Well, it's when alphas don't do much. They just kind of like they're like just uh naturally attractive and alpha, and it's referring to like beta men. It's mostly referring to like beta men like shacking up with a single mom with kids, and they're like they'll they'll support like the the mom and the kids. It's called beta bucks. You you support somebody else's kids? No, I'm giving you a, like a hypothetical like scenario you have a son? or example of what that means. You but, have a, you have a son that I didn't know about? No, and I know what you're doing right now. You're like <laughs> you're like you're opening up this whole thing. No, I don't. I'm giving you an example. Steve, of, we gotta have your son as a guest on this show. I, there is no son. There is no daughter. I'm just giving you an example of what beta bucks is. <laughs> Hashtag Stevie has a son. No. Stevie does not have a son. Stevie does not have a daughter. Stevie does not have a girlfriend. But did you? And, but, and guess what? Let me finish. And okay. Stevie's okay with that. Okay. Stevie's content with then that. Then we'll move on. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right. I love you. But I love you too. Um, 
But, you know, that was flattering. Just two grown men in wigs be like, I love you, bro. Do we look crazy? What do you think? Who looks crazier, do you think, right now? I think you do. I think I really messed up your lips. I know, but dude, you <laughs> look, those blue lips, you look like a serial killer. So how was your week? How was my week? Are you, are you eating more than once a day now? No. I think we got to fix that. Yeah. You know why? Why? If you start eating a couple times throughout the day. Keep talking. <laughs> oh, you're just going to rustle a, rustle a bag? No, I just, I have lipstick all over my fingers. I didn't mean to disrespect you. Wipe no, out. I'll put it down. <laughs> Sorry. You have a, you know what I've noticed? You have a big thing with respect. I appreciate that. Just in general. Are you being sarcastic? I, no, no, no. You're like, I respect the Watkins. You have a thing with respect I've noticed about you. It's embedded in me. For, it's a Korean thing. Do you thing. think that? It's yeah. a Korean thing. Yeah. In Korean I, culture, respect is a big thing. You respect. Is that an Asian culture in general? Respect? I, I can't speak on other specific Asian groups, but I know in Korean culture. That's very much important. It's very, like you respect, like, Elders, like even course. my brother, right? He's my older brother. Does He's he pull my that home. card on you? I still. It doesn't matter for in our 90s. I still have that respect towards him. Interesting. Okay. Uh, but I'm glad that's really that's really observant for you to well, I've to just realize a that. couple a couple episodes. You you've really like stressed on the word respect, and I think that that's something for me as uh, as you know I'm of European descent. Yeah. Um, mainly Irish and German. Yeah. I think respect is there, but I don't think we use the word that. In like, that way, you right, know what I mean? Like right. we're like respect. You better respect. Right, you know what I mean? Right, right. This no, it's different. huge in Korean culture, and yeah. uh, you notice too after we get done, like how I wanna, like, I'm mindful, right? Mm -hmm. Like if I wanna like pick things up or, you know, certain. Not everyone's like that, like you know. Oh, like, you mean like littering and stuff like that? We're just like you know that's a that's a for. Uh, well, you always that's a always, sign of respect. I always notice afterwards. You're always like, I'm gonna help you clean up. Like I really yeah, wanna. That's, that's nice. I I, 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 I appreciate. I mean that. to say that. I appreciate because a lot of people don't do that. They're just like, ah, I'm done with this, and then later, dude. Do I need to work on that? No. Oh, okay, okay, okay. No, no. Oh, don't be self conscious. I would tell. I you tell. I, him. I would let you we know. We're pretty open. I would let you know. I'd you, be like, you, dude, that's Steve fucked called up. me earlier today, and he's like, "Why are we fighting?" And then he's like, "Just kidding, we're not fighting." Oh no, no, no. I don't think we had a fight. <laughs> We've never we had, a fight. had a fight. Yet. No. No. Will it happen? Until in the right now. Until. <laughs> Until right now. <laughs> Until Listen, right now. I've got a bone to pick with you, Steve. No, everything's been working out fine. No, we've got a bone to no. pick. Yeah. Everything's positive. No, I'm, do I'm doing a bit right okay, now. Okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you got a bone to pick. Keep going. Yeah, yeah. I got a bone to pick with you. Like, yeah, like wrestling style. Like, I got a bone to pick with you, brother. Well, is that right? Yeah. Well, pick out your bone. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to see you at SummerSlam. Yeah? Yeah, brother. You better watch your back, Buster. Well, too late. I've already been I'm watching I'm hitting it. the gym raw. You're hitting the gym raw? No, that was a sound effect. Raw. Uh, I'm pretty sure you just said you're hitting the gym raw, and that's that's kind of weird, man. Raw. No, that's a little bit better, but you said originally you were hitting the gym raw. And no, that means, no, no, no. That means you're lifting weights like naked yeah. and stuff. That's weird, man. I don't know about that. We might have to change our uh, Summer Slime event. That's weird if you're going to the right. gym raw. Well, my schedule's in, open. In Whatever the raw? you want to do, you name the date and location. I'm there. I'm going to body slam you right you, on wait, the Wait, I, I, I just can't get over raw. just going to the gym raw. I don't no, know. No, I man. went raw. No, I don't know, man. Are you like naked doing curls or what's no. going on over there? You better get off the raw soon. It's really starting to irritate me. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, sorry about that. You want to go right here? Yeah, let's go right here right now. You got to get naked. This is a oil naked wrestling match. Listen, man. Ha ha, joke's on you, son. I love doing improv with you. Is this improv? <laughs> I don't know what that means. All, all I know is it's fun, 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 fun for it's everyone. Fun, everyone. It's fun, Dude, fun, fun, fun. It's a soda pop. For everyone. everyone. It's fun, 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 fun for everyone. everyone. Get fun. your fun soda today. Lemon and lime. Fun fun fun, 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 fun for everyone. everyone. 
fun, 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 fun for, for everyone. everyone. We lost it. Wait, do you think the makeup is going in her brains? No. Or maybe it is. There were two men. They were completely normal. Until one day, they put makeup on. And everything changed. Steve was a man who had everything going for him. And then, he became the sexiest woman alive. Glamour shots, glamour shots. Stevie Weeby is the sexiest woman alive. What's it like to be that perfect? Nobody knows. On a scale of one to 10, He's 10,000. <laughs> do it for me, do it for me. Jeremiah Watkins used to be an ordinary woman, but now she has advanced into a mega woman from a time capsule from 1988. He has re-emerged, ladies and gentlemen, into a advanced, new... <laughs> Why do you have to look so serious? And, like, this is what you look like. Like I was doing, like, the, the, let's go back to the song, right? You were like, you were looking at them. You were like, you like, dude. You don't have to be that intense. I go for it. Okay, that was so fun. That was fun. That was fun. Can we do a little bit of a dance break? Yes. Let's do it. <laughs> okay, so here's what I'm thinking. Yeah, normally we do the dance break, standing up and moving around, and you know we even did one driving, but mm -hmm. sometimes. It's hard to just get out of bed. Have you ever been there? Oh, every other day. It's hard to just get out of your bed. And this is an exercise, and it's just like, it's just like the thing to help you get motivated to get out of bed or just to dance along with us in bed. You don't have to leave the comfort of your home, okay? That's great. Right? Yeah, this is going to be comfortable. Can now, I forgot the music. Can I add it in later? Yeah, for sure. Okay. <laughs> It's our weirdest. Yeah, it's our weirdest. We don't need to apologize or anything. No, do we? no, no, no. We don't. I don't know about you, but I'm having such a weird, fun time. I think this is the most funnest but weirdest episode yet. Yeah. I love it. Do you? It's love made it? me belly laugh like hard, hard a couple times. We should do more stuff like this, experimental. Yeah, of course. Out, I th outside I think, the box. What do you guys think? Do you like this experimental stuff? You can comment Let below. Let us know. Let us know. Thank you for liking, we re subscribing. Mm -hmm. And uh, and sharing all that stuff, like we always say. Um, and we want to give a shout out now to our Scissor family who have been who sending an amazing submissions. contribution, submissions to the show. Yeah, we love the videos. We love the art, the music, everything. So we're going to play some of the videos and music and some of the art right now. Thank you. We love you.
All right, Gigi. Say hi, Scissor Bros. Hi, Scissor Bros. All right, go ahead. Show me scissors. So you, so you soaped up your asshole. Hi, Steve. Hi, Jeremiah. Um, this isn't my favorite thing to have to do, but can you explain to me why under all of my Instagram posts and tweets, there's a billion scissors, little scissor emoji. I didn't understand what's happening. I thought, first I thought people were calling me a lesbian. Then I thought people were making plastic surgery jokes. Then I thought people were like, you know, I don't know, doing a full house reference, cut it out. I didn't know, I thought I was being canceled. Like you're gone. Um. I mean, I'm sure all of those things are probably going to happen too, but what, I need to adopt you. Is that, is that what's going on? Is that what it's come to? Um, this doesn't feel consensual. Uh, and what does this entail? I think I need to understand more of what this entails. If I'm going to adopt you for a day, like a, like a, like a make a wish kid. Is that the idea? Do I get like a break on my taxes for... Is this like a chair? It's like a charity thing. I think we're going to end up going to Whitney's place. I don't want to jinx it, but I think it's going to happen. Oh my! I think it's. God. I think it's going to happen eventually. I think that really? that's the doorway. She Facetimed me earlier, dude. This is unbelievable news. This is huge news. This is Thank huge. you guys for showing your Thanks, support. Thanks, guys. And the girl, power and gals, guys, gals, non-binary of all genders, all races, Absolutely. all religions. We include everybody here, our, our scissor family. Thanks for making that happen. They made it happen. That. You we guys did, did that. Y'all did it. We didn't do it. She literally FaceTimed me. She's like, and texted me. She's like, what, what, what's going on? She got my number. Wow. She got my number. You didn't have her number before? No. Well, she has it now. She has it now. She was texting me. She was like, what's all this scissor stuff? Thank you, guys. Thank you for making that happen, ladies and gentlemen. That's amazing. Let's get into our closing song. Okay. Eight now. Woo! I'm all alone. 
There's no anybody calling my phone. I tried to get the promotion, but I got denied. Hit me on my beeper. Thanks for tuning in. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for tuning in. We love you. We'll see you next week. Hey, did you guys like that? Was it too weird? Was it too Do you much? like the weirdness? Do you, li- do you like it? We love it. We had fun. We love it. We love it. www.youtube.com slash scissor bros. We only subscribe. <laughs>